And here's a gentleman that earned his PhD from University of Southern California. He could have really done anything, but he chose the FBI. Inside the FBI's Milwaukee field office, I spoke with officials about former special agent in charge, John Glover, the first black person to ever head a field office, and it happened in Milwaukee from 1979 to 1980. It started a movement in the FBI of, of seeing more minorities of all races, uh, gender, etc., rising in the, the ranks of the FBI. Glover was also the only black Quantico graduate in his class in the 1960s. He actually was appointed as an agent in 1966, which you can imagine that was a, a very crucial time in the civil rights movements. He had the ability, just through his actions alone, of being an African American in the positions that he was in to be a role model for many. Present day Glover's movement continues through a diversity fair in Milwaukee, a passion for someone who knows firsthand what representation can do. It helps folks like myself. I grew up in this community, uh, and the more you can build a dream, to say, that could be me too. Jornay Amara, WISN 12 News. Glover retired as one of three executive assistant directors who reported straight to the FBI director. He now lives in Florida.